A rise in deadly infectious diseases and rampant malnutrition are two of the lifelong illnesses that climate change could bring to future generations. More than 120 global health experts have contributed to a new study that looks at the devastating impact to public health. Now, children across the world are already getting sick from air pollution and extreme weather events, but it could be far worse for the future generations. This report by the Lancet Countdown, it's a coalition of institutions, including the World Health Organization, shows that more children are becoming susceptible to infectious disease. It says due to the warming climate, waterborne bacteria that cause diarrhea are able to spread much faster. This boosts the likelihood of children contracting diseases such as cholera. Mosquito-borne illnesses like dengue and malaria are also spreading more rapidly. Now, climate change is going to cause those stocks of staple foods around the world, like corn, rice and wheat, to plunge. Infants and small children are at the most risk from this crop failure. Malnutrition can stunt their growth, and weaken their immune systems and cause long-term developmental problems. Coal-fired power stations alone are thought to contribute to more than a million deaths each year. But experts say heat waves, wildfires and dangerously high levels of urban air pollution will also spike rates of premature deaths and disease. Now around the world, a child born today is expected to live through till 2090. And researchers say if nations don't drastically cut their emissions soon, the Earth will be on track for a rise of 4 degrees Celsius in temperature by the turn of the century. That is a big enough increase to manifest many of those disasters that scientists have warned us about. It would also overburden the already strained health systems across the world.